good morning. Uh, just woke up, got my contacts in. <laughs> We're heading offshore today, leaving Beaufort. I'm gonna go start the engine and we'll see you when we get offshore. Too much bay sailing. And then, yeah, too much <laughs> bay too long. This is our first ocean in... Months. Four? Five That's months? It. July, Chesapeake? August. Yeah, it's good. It's, of course, we're fighting the current here too. All right, we've, we've jived. I also got a tanker coming in me, huh, doggy? Well, you're leaving the channel, right? Yeah. Just to catch that on video. <laughs> okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I need a security for that boat. Okay. You just went through, and it ended up tipping us so far back and forth. I was sitting up there, and I slid all the way to here. So now this is my spot. And yeah, that's like another one, but it was a lot bigger and we were pretty, pretty far up. So I just slid over here. <laughs> yeah. Now we're sailing. I like it. Hey, I'm Matt, this is Nancy, and Olivia. Up, We've uprooted our suburb family to find a new cadence in life. Cadence is more than our home. It's the driving idea behind the balance and rhythm we seek. Less stuff, more experience. I'm glad you joined us today. And if you're new here, please subscribe. Resting? You staying warm? Trying to. It's not too cold. 50 degrees now? Mm -hmm. You look like it's too cold. It's too cold for me. Take me to the Caribbean. I'm pretty cold too. I'm gonna get a hat on. <laughs> so um, we've gone about 15 miles, nautical miles from the anchorage. We have 55 more to go. It's nice. 8 a.m. It's really calmed down out here too. It has calmed down. Upper teens for the win. Gusting 20. We're struggling to stay above six and a half knots, so. See my little dog in there? The awesome statement. The statement is it's freaking cold outside. It's not that bad today. No, it's not. But it is when you're wearing shorts and a t-shirt like I was earlier. <laughs> Well, the uh, temperature's dropping out there, so we're going to get layered up. This is a kind of a lightweight shirt, medium weight. So I'm gonna put a fleece underneath, and then I'm gonna get some hand warmers for the girls. Put in their pockets. Do you hear that noise? propeller spinning. When we get about seven, seven and a half knots, it spins like that. Now, I can already tell you the YouTube comments. I'm supposed to put it in gear and uh, that'll stop the spinning. Yeah, we've heard that. And so I guess different transmissions are different. Ours says to, uh, the manual says to leave it neutral. It's less wear than putting it in gear and creating that tension on the 
gears, I guess. Anyway, let's go up here. We're making good speed. Six and a half, seven knots. Still blowing 20. Some pretty good seas over here. So it's almost lunch time. We're gonna cook up some ramen noodles, but we'll probably give a little update. Sea state's good. Three to five footers coming through, nothing big. And uh, we got a cool yacht. Is it a mega yacht? You know, it's like a personal cruise ship. That's kind of cool. And I was thinking to myself, and this dinghy is like this 30 foot, 40 foot offshore fishing boat that's towing. So they're having a great time, I can imagine. Uh, them in their slippers and their sweaters, sipping hot chocolate, watching TV. With the heater on. The heater on. Ladies doing pedicures. Uh, I don't know if guys playing pool, if they play pool on a boat like that. Then some captain taking the boat. And then I was telling Nancy, I was like, you know how much fuel they're burning? You know how much we're burning? <laughs> kind of nice. It's a good day. Nothing against them. I think that's pretty cool. But this is nice too. Um, we got the full general wind out. It's 18 to 20 knots of consistent wind. It's not really gusting anymore. Like it's 18, gusting 20. We are uh, just adjusting course for about 150 degrees off the wind. So almost straight down the wind. We're down with the waves. Things are good, if not a little chilly. It's a little frisky up here. A little frisky. A little chilly. Down right pole. <laughs> My fingers. Very comfortable up here. Downwind. This is the place to be. Even the cabins down below. The forward cabin is more comfortable going downwind than the aft cabin. Of course, going upwind is the opposite. Well, it took us all day, from Beaufort just before sunrise, all the way to Wrightsville just at sunset. But we are excited to make it because it's here where we will pick up our crewmate and now friend, Tony. Food here, Nance. Lovely. <laughs> All right, Nance. What's uh what's happening on port side of Cadence tonight? So today is a very special day. We have a special guest on board. We have Tony with us. Tony, well, welcome, Tony. Glad to be here. Thank you so much for inviting me. I'm Absolutely. excited to be here with, with Matt, Olivia, and Nancy, and of course Mocha. Yes. So, <laughs> she's awesome. over here sniffing food out. Yeah, she's probably eating the food while we're And uh, we're gonna head south together, right? Absolutely. I'll stay until you kick me off, but like I told you, you know, if you could pull over to a dock when you kick me off. We'll do that. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> we'll do that. I hope you brought your swim here. Yeah. <laughs> well, I guess it's time to eat. Let's, Let's do it. <laughs> no, we have a new one. Well, you didn't tell me that when I got on the boat. We didn't have that build swamp. <laughs> we yeah. have a new one. Oh, we have a new one. Okay. But we're not leaking, right? We're not leaking. We've been without the build swamp, actually. Where's the pump? 
So like uh, 15 minutes before I got here, yeah. it quit. <laughs> Plus 45 days. <laughs> so, it's been that, long? That, that offshore yeah. sale we just did, we didn't have a bilge pump hey, for that. Hey, Nancy, I that. think he forgot to tell me we didn't have a bilge pump. I mean, I slept here last night, you know. So, uh, so got here. All right, so an empty switch box because we didn't do the pump yet. We installed a new switch. The old switch was, I don't know toast. where it is. It was toast. <laughs> it was jammed. It, the float wasn't fluctuating so we put a new one in we didn't have all the right electrical parts yet so we're gonna have to uh, kind of redo the job once we get to a marina that's all she wrote captain nance hey how's it going uh, this is the easy part yeah it's a little cold up here for me though. you did a fabulous job on the end thank you so much Yes. All right, you guys have fun. Bye, Nancy. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you. Thanks for helping, Tony. Oh, you're certainly welcome. Everybody. It's really dark. <laughs> we are in the cockpit. We're actually in the cockpit right now. We're not in a dark closet. <laughs> Look, you can't see anybody. Hey, you can't see me either, can you? But yeah. What are we cooking? We are having scrambled eggs with oatmeal and some sauteed onion and bell pepper. Oh my goodness. Another 10 pounds for <laughs> so. Matt, trash duty. <laughs> I'm uh, gonna go drop it in the anchor box. Mocha, how are you doing this morning? Hey Mocha. Where are you going today Mocha? Are you going sailing? You are? Are you excited? You are? Awesome. We're on our way aren't we Mocha? Tell all your fans. <laughs> See you later. Where are we going, Nancy? We are going to Southport, North Carolina. We have a marina tonight. It's just like a big fancy privilege now. We're going to plug up and enjoy some heat and some hot water. And Does that mean like long hot showers? Long hot shower. <laughs> you know, not those sailor showers. So I'm so excited. <laughs> What's happening, Matt? Got a little north wind behind us. Not much, about 10 knots. We got about a two knot current underneath us pushing against us. So we're only going about four. We timed that just right. You only do what you can do, I guess. <laughs> nice. We made it to Safe Harbor Southport. And uh, Chef Nance in the galley. Mm -hmm. Crewmate Tony. Yay! You step on, you step on as a crewmate, step off as a friend. And there you go. And, uh, he was at the helm today. It was good, wasn't it? It was excellent. Easy? Thank you. It was easy? It was not, well, it was, that big ship was a little taxi. <laughs> but <laughs> once I got it off of autopilot, I felt yeah, much more comfortable. I agree, there's some things. But that was good. Mm -hmm. Stir fry. Mm. Make Kathy jealous. <laughs> <laughs> but we figured out the problem. The problem wasn't the pump after all, which was broke and the check valve. No water could flow through it. So we took it off. We uh, just jiggled it a bit with the screwdriver and broke it free. Here, I'll blow it in. Let's see if you can get that on the video. Can you see down that hole? Yeah. Okay, it so. Locked up the camera. So we cleared it up and now water can flow through. We're gonna put it back on. The pump was good. Um, the switch was bad, so we have a new switch. Repaired check valve. I think we're going to get it. We won't sink the boat, Tony. I get a feeling in my bones that I'm just one. Captain Matt, what are we doing? Well, Tony, we're heading off. Uh, just filled the tanks, and we're leaving Southport. Short little trip today, about six hours on the water, heading to North Myrtle Beach. A lot of cloud cover out there offshore, so we're avoiding all that. Should be a good day offshore, but we're not doing it because we won't have the sunshine, and in here we have sunshine. Matter of fact, we've got our jeans on, but I think we're talking about putting some shorts on. What do you think? I think so. T-shirts and shorts today. Yeah, it's a good day. 68 yes. degrees, sunshine. Well, I made these curtains back in Beaufort. And so Tony brought us a hammer and we're gonna put some grommets in it today. So I'm marking them. So when we get back to the dock, we can use the hammer on the dock. Awesome. Beautiful day, sunshine.
We picked up a quick 40 miles today, traveling from Southport to North Myrtle Beach. Wind and wave splash walkers. I don't know what I'm calling them. All right. Put the it's Matt very hard at work. Boat Project 37. <laughs> oh, Captain Matt. Yep. Captain Matt. So where are we going? Uh, let's see, where are we heading now? Georgetown, but we're going to stop in the Waltham Mall tonight. Nasty storm coming in this afternoon. It's already looking a little cloudy this way, and we're going to tuck down behind the swamp trees and enjoy the evening. Grilled salmon, I think we're having. Mm. Yes, back on Cadence with the Fosters. Beautiful weather. It's just cloudy, but warm, finally. And we're getting, uh, having a good day starting off. Can't wait to look forward to what the day holds. We should have a, a good sale today. Wash me in the water. Cleanse me in the mercy of your love. I need a heavenly First, let's see if we can take this jet out right here. Let's see if we got, it's gonna be kind of tight. I'll try to hold it. Sometimes they'll have a ball, sometimes it's just a jet. You wanna look through it? You can see right see, through it, huh? Yeah, see if you can see right through that. And uh, because there could be a chunk of. Uh... See through it? So that is the jet. Yes. That's the jet for the carburetor. Yeah. Inside, you'll see where it actually builds up and on. It's, it's varnished. It makes kind of a varnish in there. If that lets go and goes through a jet, it'll just stop it up. And so get all of that trash in and trash you can out of it. Oops, so we're going to spray in, scrape a little. Mm -hmm. so, yeah, so we'll spray back right back in this section. It's definitely built up here. And then we'll also spray in these passages here to make sure it's all good and clean. Awesome. This marks our second time in the Waccamaw River, and I just can't say how much we love it. Grilled cheese and tomato soup. On homemade bread. Look at that. Good job, Nance. Thanks. How's it look, Tony? It looks fabulous. I am so hungry. Oh, yeah. Oh, such a chef. How's the anchorage? The anchorage is beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. I can't believe we didn't have to pay for this. Because <laughs> <laughs> this would have been worth paying for. I believe that. It is gorgeous. Going to Georgetown today. It's an easy day, about five hours. We're going to fuel up, water up, and get ready to go offshore tomorrow. So after a half day traveling down the Waccamaw River, we finally made it to Georgetown, the lovely town, where we refreshed, took rest, and prepared ourselves for the final leg of the United States East Coast. Hey, thanks for watching today's episode. Would you do us a favor and would you share this video with a friend? Anyway, big, big windstorm tomorrow, through the night tomorrow. We're gonna tuck away and wait till Monday. In Genoa, this is a, a relatively large debate in the in the sailing world. It's a little rough walking. coming out of the inlet. We had some good waves. You guys really see got dolphins by the boat. It's so exciting to see. Just drive straight. Drive straight. <laughs> Can we heal the boat over? To you want to do it? 